Well, we have been in need of a semi remodel on our pool out here and our deck had fallen substantially, especially after the storms we had at the end of the year. We had a lot of water in the yards and around and the rear corners of our pool deck had dropped, uh, one side I think had dropped nearly three inches at least. And uh, there were other spots on the deck where you could see cracks where it obviously had just become unstable underneath. So we knew we needed to do something. And I also, I wanted to put a new surface on there and we decided we were gonna use pavers. And the paving people that I spoke with, the first thing they said was, you, you've got to get this deck level and uh, you know, get it back in good condition or that will reflect in your paving job. So uh, that's the reason we decided to go ahead and do this. One of my neighbors used another company and they decided they wanted to use concrete. And uh, the main thing I can tell you was I got a quote from that gentleman there and the price I wound up paying uh, Helicon was uh, just a little over one third what the concrete was gonna cost. And I, it looks to me like the results are as good as I could ever dream of. They, they turned out really good. That funding that I saved right there was almost enough to pay for the pavers. I was uh, very impressed. Your guys got here promptly when they said they were going to, and they stayed the entire day. They worked all day long. Uh, this was a four-man team you had that came here and I was really impressed with what they did and they, they took their time and they, they used some measuring devices that I haven't seen before that I'm not accustomed, of, but it, uh, accustomed to, but you, can, you could see them actually bringing the deck exactly where they wanted it to be. And it was a lot of work because the deck had problems all the way around. I was also impressed with the equipment they had. They had this giant trailer and I just peeped inside of it, but I could see computer and all kind of uh, pumps and generators and stuff uh, so they it really was a professional job and it was done promptly uh, the guys were very courteous they cleaned up well when they finished and they did exactly what they told me and also they made sure that my expectations and theirs were going to be the same we knew that it was not going to be 100 percent perfect which is really hard to do but they sure got it close and i was very pleased it actually turned out better than i had assumed it would. I was kind of expecting the worst and uh, the guys really did a good job of, of getting this deck straightened out and leveled up and the pavers they've come in now and uh, the work they're doing to satisfy themselves and they're uh, a little more particular than I am but they want their pavers job to look good as well and it needs to start with a good foundation. From what I can see right now it, it really looked amazing once they got the deck brought up but now that we're getting the pavers installed, uh, it's just going to give it a whole new dynamic. Uh, it makes, to me, it makes the deck look larger and it's certainly uh, more attractive than it was before. And hopefully just a few more days and that job will be finished. So the performance of the workers there is just great. They do a very good job. They're very knowledgeable. And uh, the number two thing, which this might even be number one, because I'm retired now. I've been retired for three months. so. I was absolutely squeezing my pennies. And uh, the amount of money we saved by not going with some other options, like I said before, it, it virtually paid for the deck, the uh, pavers, and, and I was just very pleased. So if you're interested in a good quality job and, uh, and also in the cost, which everyone is gonna be interested in, I would certainly uh, get a quote from Helicon at least and compare it to what some of the others are saying and uh, maybe you can even get an opportunity to look at some jobs they've done uh, just to see how it turns out but uh, I've seen ads before and uh, you can see where the pavement actually comes up but when you stand there and watch it yourself and they've got this little gauge that they kind of put on there to trigger what's or watch what's going on as they do it and uh, it's quite impressive.